Hello friends, as you probably already know, January 14, 2020, the official date of death of the Windows 7 system. On this day, extended support for the system ended. But what does this mean for users with Windows 7? Can they continue to use this system? I want to reassure you. You can, but carefully. And more later. Windows 7 was released on 22nd October 2009, and it is not surprising that its support has expired. However, about 30% of computers work on this system. And Microsoft wants users to switch to Windows 10 already. And if at the time of 10's release you didn't make the transition for free, now you will have to pay for it. If you decide to buy a license, cheap prices for licenses for both the 10 and the 7 on our website your laptop. Link in the description. But you can stay on the 7 if you really want to. The fact that support has expired means that Microsoft is no longer releasing updates. This also applies to security updates. Only in versions of Windows 7 Professional and Windows 7 Enterprise extended support for security updates until 10th of January 2023. Therefore, if you have a home or ultimate version and you don't have any security updates, you should take care about the antivirus and monitor the safe use of the Internet. Do not download anything and do not climp where you do not need to. With security it is clear, we can follow it ourselves. Do you need updates that had stopped on January 14? They are needed if you use the latest programs, play the most modern games or add new devices to your computer that have new drivers. I think that in this case you are most likely already using Windows 10. If you have a stable computer, it suits you. The set of programs that you used before suits you. You monitor the security. So what prevents you from using Windows 7? Some still use Windows XP on old PCs. You can also continue to use the 7. Press like and write a comment if you will. One more question. Many have a Pirate 7. If you buy a license for Windows 7 after January 14, will it work? Yes, and as we said, the corporate version of Windows 7 Enterprise, by the way, it is very fast, as well as professional, will receive security updates until 2023. I hope this video helped you, perhaps reassured, or maybe prompted some decisions. In any case, thank you for watching. If you still have questions, write in the comments, I will try to answer. Stay on the PCNP channel, there will be a lot of interesting and useful videos about working with the computer and the Internet. See you on there, friends!